So, uh, as you can see, uh, the land that we have is sloping towards north and it's also sloping towards the east. So, we have close to about uh, 12 degrees slope in our land. Uh, so, whenever you have a slope that is less than 20 degrees, you can do contour trenches, you can do swales, uh, you can make beds which are parallel to the contours uh, to conserve water, uh, to uh, stop the flow of topsoil and various other benefits. So, what we have done here is uh, wherever the slope was intense, uh, we made uh, swales one after the other, uh, consecutive swales and wherever the slope uh, was low in terms of intensity, what we did was we uh, uh, spaced the swales apart, 15 meters apart. Now, I want to tell you what a swale is. Uh, a swale is nothing but a ditch which is dug on a contour line. A contour line is a line where all the points are at the same altitude from uh, the mean sea level. So, when, a water, uh, when the water falls in a contour ditch, it does not flow anymore. It just raises in its level and the only way it can go is uh, uh, under the ground. This is called a swale. Uh, what we first do is we draw a contour line at this point and once we have the contour line, we draw lines on either side and start uh, uh, chiseling the sides of the swale at 45 degrees angle. The bottom has to be at the exact same level all along the length. Okay? So, at the bottom it has to be at the same exact level all the way and uh, we create the walls at 45 degrees uh, angles. Once we have this, whenever it rains and once it starts filling up, the water level raises uniformly all along the swale. So, uh, water level keeps raising uniformly all along the length of the swale. And once it rises, the whole weight of the water falls on the downstream side of the swale, which is this side. So, the weight of the water is on this side and the water goes underground and it just uh, flows underground and uh, creates a spring down the stream you actually start seeing that. So, uh, most of that water in that pond has gone under the ground, below the swales here. Uh, that is about close to about 8 feet deep and it is filled up now. So, we have about 16 swales in this uh, uh, in this one acre plot. Uh, so, we made uh, 12 swales right next to one another. There the slope was very intense. It was close to about 15 degree uh, slope and mud. We made uh, one swale after the other, after the other, after the other, like 12. And after that, every 15 meters, we put uh, one swale, four such. So, we have a total of 16 swales in this land.